Okay, everybody, so while we <coughs> await our main instructor for today to arrive, so I'm not Klaus Schulten, <laughs> um, I'm going to give you a, a brief introduction and welcome speech. And it's, it's great to see such a full house here. So it's nice that you all could make it today to our workshop. So my name is Marcus Dittrich. I'm um, director of the Biomedical Applications Group here at the Pittsburgh Supercomputing Center, and I'm one of the organizers of this workshop. Um, so PC is part of Carnegie Mellon University, and we're also part of a new center called MMBIOS, which is one of the two um, groups that have been organizing this workshop. So the main organizers of this workshop is the Theoretical and Computational Biophysics Group um, in Urbana-Champaign, Illinois and the Nation, uh, National Center for Multiscale Modeling of Biological Systems, or MMBIOS as we call it, which is located here in Pittsburgh. So these are the two groups organizing um, this workshop. And I just want to say a brief few words about what, what these groups are and what they do. And um, you'll hear much more about this um, later. And assuming these slides will actually do something. It's always technology. Ah, all right. So um, the theoretical and computational biophysics group, or how it's, it's also called the National Center for Macromolecular Modeling and Bioinformatics, which is led by Klaus Schulten, who will give most of today's and tomorrow's lectures. Um, it's, it's, this group has been doing, um, has been in existence for a long time, I think over 20 years now. So here's a recent group picture, and you, you probably know them as the developers of the popular VMD and NAMD tools for molecular modeling. So the focus of the TCBG really is to develop tools and methodologies and software to help you simulate um, these biomolecular um, systems and also beyond at some, at some point. And so Klaus will say much more about this, so I don't want to um, belabor this point very much. So this is um, the TCBG, and um, MMBIOS is a new center that was just founded two years ago, a little bit more than, or almost two years ago, um, that is a collaboration between University of Pittsburgh, Carnegie Mellon University, the PSC, and the SOG Institute. Um, in San Diego or La Jolla. And the theme of MMBIOS really is to develop methods and tools um, that really bridge the scale from molecular to cellular to tissue. So that's one of the goals. Of course, this is a you know, grandiose sounding goals, but we want to take some first steps and really try and integrate these tools and being able to come up with methodologies that can really help you to go from you know, what would be the biomolecular scale to the to the tissue scale. And, and one of the main focus areas of this, of many things that we do at MMBIOS is a neural signaling system, synapses, brain, um, sort of these, these types of things. And so the goal here really is to integrate these scales. So you, you may be most familiar with this scale, that's a molecular scale, where you deal with all the atoms, the water molecules, you see nanometer scales. Then there is the um, subcellular scales, where, deal, where you're on the micron scale, so this is actually a reconstruction of a neuron in the hippocampus, and then all the way up to brain scales, where you have connections of neurons, um, and you want to understand how they work. And so we develop, as part of MMBIOS, and so I'm one of the um, members of MMBIOS, we develop a number of tools. The one you'll learn about today is PRODI, which is really, again, focused on the biomolecular scale, dealing with biomolecular systems. But we also develop tools for cell-level simulations. One of them is M-Cell and Hello, class, and Cell Blender, and also tools at the tissue level. Um, and so just in case this, may be, this is of interest to you, we just had a workshop two weeks ago on cell modeling using M-Cell. So if, if next year, perhaps, you're interested in learning more about these types of tools, you know, check out our website and you may find that we have another workshop on this um, next year. And so the goal here really for us is that we try to take steps toward integrating these different, um, these different scales and the tools at these scales to, to allow you uh, to better 
um, really connect between them. And so um, let me briefly just talk about the agenda um, for this workshop. So it's a five-day workshop. We start today with um, an introduction to protein structure and dynamics uh, by Dr. Shulton. Uh, and tomorrow then go over to statistical mechanics of proteins. So the way that this works is we'll have lectures in the morning in this room every day. And then right behind you through this door is a computer lab where you will be doing hands-on tutorials that are prepared that you can actually learn to apply these methodologies that you have heard about in the morning. So we'll be here in the mornings and then the afternoon we go next door and do the tutorials. Um, uh, um, lunch is usually around noon, and lunch will be served. If you go out the door here to the left, there's a room, so it'll be in there. One, one request I have, please, if at all possible, don't bring any food into the computer lab. We'll try to um, keep our keyboards as clean as possible. So if, if you can avoid it, if you have water or something, that's fine, but maybe not pizza and stuff like that. Then we had, um, we'll organize participant presentations tomorrow. Um, a couple of you have indicated interest in presenting their work in the evening, so this will start. So the plan is to have that run 7 through 9 p.m. Is, is that still a good time? We can start later. So if, if I don't hear any, any uh, complaints, we'll do this 7 to 9 p.m. I think 10 people had said they would be interested in presenting. Um, if anybody else wants to present but they said no initially, that's fine. So what I would suggest is everybody who would like to present for sure, send me an email, maybe with a title of, with your name and the title of your presentation so I can have a roster of who, who wants to present tomorrow. Um, if, if we have 10 people, so we really have to um, really ask you to keep it down to 10 minutes. Otherwise, we'll, we'll still be talking at midnight. So maybe try 10 minutes. So it, it's always difficult, but if, if you try to just make it a 10-minute talk, then we have some time for discussions, and we don't run too late. Are there any questions about the presentations? So you can just connect your laptop here, PowerPoint, PDF, whatever you have is fine. Try to make it 10 minutes. We can have a quick discussion, questions. And so that should be fun. It was a lot of fun last year. OK, so Wednesday, then we have Computation Nanobio. Um, and then on Thursday, we go over to um, these more higher level me methods talking about collective dynamics of proteins using elast elastic network models. Um, that's um, going to be done by Yvette Bahar, Chakra, who is in the back here already, and um, um, Tim Lazan. And Friday, we'll talk about drugability and analyzing sequence patterns and structural dynamics. So it's a really nice program, I, I think, that goes from um, sort of the uh, starts from the protein structures and goes all the way up to higher level systems, sequences, and also the more um, coarse-grained uh, approaches. And so um, are there any questions about how this is going to work? I think there should also be an agenda in that folder that you have that kind of gives the time. So yes, no, please. So we'll, we'll definitely post all the slides. We'll try to post them as soon as possible. So as soon as maybe, if Klaus, if you're done today, you can send me your slides. And we'll put them up as soon as possible. So they might, the slides for today might be up today. So we'll, we'll try to really get them up as soon as we can. One thing I should mention, well, as you can see, we're trying to film these lectures. So there's a camera rolling here. And um, so we'll. Um, also make these videos available on the web. So that'll take a little bit because it, that takes some work to actually cut those and, and so. But they'll be also be available at some point. So slides and movie uh, videos of the lectures will be available. OK, so I just want to end with showing you the workshop team. So it's a large number of people who have really worked hard to um, show you all the, bring to you all the tutorials and lectures today. So we have a good, nice set of instructors um, and teaching assistants that would help, will help you also in the afternoon sections. Um, and if there's any questions um, during the workshop, feel free to contact me or Pat Sudak if you have any questions. We'll try to hopefully get you accommodated as, as good as we can. 
Are there any other just general questions? Otherwise, we um, can start. Again, I'll be here during the week, so if, if there's any other questions, you can grab me. Klaus, are you ready? <coughs> so I'm very happy to introduce Klaus Schulten, who is um, the, the, the head of the TCBG and the master of NAMD and VMD, and who will tell us all about MD simulations. 